Hello and welcome to this video. My name's Adam and this channel is called About A Van. You can also find me on Instagram for more regular updates. Now in this video, it's very quick, but I just want to tell you why the differences between um, this unit here um, and another thing that Victor on sale, which is called a Smart Shunt. Now this one is the battery monitor and this is the BMV712. Um, previously on my last build, I installed a Smart Shunt and that gave me connectivity to my phone. I was very happy to be able to see that remotely and not have a physical display somewhere in my van. However, if you do want that, then you're gonna to wanna to opt for the 712, which is this unit here. And that comes with a nice display, which you can get in black or silver. Um, and it also comes with the data cable needed to get that on your control panel. So, if you don't want to be able to see your display all the time from somewhere in your van and you're happy to connect on your phone, then the Smart Shunt is gonna be fine for you. If you're gonna be running an alternative screen, something like the um, Touch GX50 by Victron, and then you also will not use this, then you can connect that with the Smart Shunt and save yourself a little bit of money. This does also enable Bluetooth, so even if you choose to have one of these, you can still view this on your phone as well. So it doesn't mean that you have to choose one over the other. You can have both. However, if you're not worried about having the screen somewhere in your van, you can save yourself around 70 pounds and you can monitor everything from your phone. I hope this has been helpful. If it has, um, then please give it a thumbs up. If you've got any questions about the BMV or the Smart Shunt, then please chuck them in the comments below and I will get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks for watching. Take care.